What up fools? So we're hitting a leg day today. This is gonna be the first leg day that I've posted on here. We're gonna show you what it's about and uh, what I do. Usually all of my all of my lifts are kind of the same. I haven't really changed everything. I change reps, but I mainly just do big compound lifts. On leg days though, I usually do a lot more machine work, mainly because it's a lot easier to target specific muscle groups in the legs with machines like hamstring curls, uh, leg extensions. Because like a back squat is going to target overall just leg development. That's why you need to do back squats because it's going gonna, it's gonna to give you a good base for your legs. But if you want to fine tune them and you hit pick up lagging parts like I was talking about my upper chest is lagging so I focus upper chest. Well if you want to fine tune your legs and uh, see more parts pick up you gotta start doing stuff like that you gotta start focusing and you know hamstrings because hamstrings is a little smaller than my quads um my calves are medium sized I, I need to do those more but you can't just keep doing back squats and letting other other parts on your legs overgrow everything else and expect like oh my hamstrings aren't fucking getting any bigger i'm gonna just keep back squatting well fucking hit hamstrings you know do some rdls do some uh leg curls focus on that muscle that's lacking and hit that shit um but yeah we're gonna go in there we're gonna start with a big compound movement that's usually how i like to start my my workouts because it's the it's the heavy shit it's the hard shit get it out of the way and then start doing the accessory work so we're gonna start with a back squat probably on smith machine just because it's easier to have that mind muscle connection on the smith machine so we're gonna go fucking eat that shit and uh see what's about I don't give a fuck about shit. Nice chain, red ball mains. Chain swing, like pretty things. Kick a bitch, call me Lil Kane. Dumb bitch, give me dumb brain. Wrist wet, wet like rain. Nike swoosh, white cocaine. Ice burn, that's Gucci Mane. Tall racks, like yeah. Just finished squatting. We did a huge superset just like our bench that we did. We did 315 for round eight, 225 for round 10, and then 135 for 10. Um, I tried to go as fast as possible. Finished that 315, took off the plate, finished that 225, took off the plate, did 135, and finished it right there. Just once you finish that, you want to take off that weight as soon as possible and just keep it as a superset. You don't want to give yourself a break. You don't want your muscle to regenerate. You want to keep killing it. Um, we're about to do a few burnout sets on 225. Focusing on form, just because I haven't been squatting that match. We're gonna finish that off, and then we're gonna go do hamstring curls. Yeah, fuck these niggas cause they always been extra All these diamonds on me, I don't feel no pressure Money coming in like I am an investor She tried to take a break but I already left her oh, When I'm in my car, yeah, whoa Look up at the stars, just like, whoa No feelings involved, yeah, no feelings involved Put that on my dogs, I say no feelings involved Put that on my dogs, put that on my dogs I said no feelings involved Okay, okay, I don't need it, I don't need it I don't want it, I won't keep it Matter of fact, I might delete it Alright, 
right, so we just finished uh, leg curls or hamstring curls. We did a bunch of drop sets again. Um, notice when I'm doing them, my calves aren't flexed, so they're really relaxed. I'm just pulling my hamstrings. And towards the end of the set, when you're getting towards failure, you can actually flex your calves to get a few extra reps in, so you're not using as much hamstring. So you're kind of getting that initial movement with the calf, but it's helping you get more reps with the hamstring. So in the end, it's it's pushing your hamstrings harder than than they would if you just gave up right then. So you know, do that little extra to get those extra reps in and uh, grow those hamstrings. Doing leg extensions now, focusing on the teardrop. So we're caving the feet inwards to really focus on that teardrop, get that up. My left leg's a little smaller, so I really try to focus on that left leg when I do these. I could do singles, but we've been here a really long time, so we're trying to speed through this. And um, that's what we're doing. These niggas cause they always been extra All these diamonds on me, I don't feel no pressure Money coming in like I am an investor She tried to take a break but I already left her oh, When I'm in my car, yeah, whoa Look up at the stars, just like, whoa No feelings involved, yeah, no feelings involved Put that on my dark like, ooh I might move yeah. Wish that you were me Cause you're not cool, you're not cool. Yeah. yeah Looking like a fool Like a dog barking at the moon Alright, we just finished extensions About to do thigh abductors Yeah, that's where you go away um, Extensions were solid Like I said, we were just focusing on Making that teardrop Caving the legs in, the toes in um, Now we're about to do these Thigh abductors. Oh my god, my quads are so tight. Oh shit. Jesus Christ. Alright, we're better to do thigh abductors. Try to get um that fucking, you know, that fat ass. Uh my glutes are lacking. I got huge legs, just a and just a medium ass, you know. I don't get I don't cast a shadow or anything, but that's what we're trying to do. Get that get those glutes a little thicker, you know. We're just gonna do uh, high reps, drop sets, everything, everything we want. Uh, that's, that's what I've been doing for like the past week is literally just coming in here, whatever muscle's not sore, just fucking hitting it. Um, taking it to failure or as much as I can handle physically and mentally and uh, doing that. I can definitely feel that ass getting a little fatter. Um, this is probably my favorite glute exercise, that and probably donkey kicks. They're known as two girl exercises, but that's why girls have fat asses, because they do glute focused exercises. So I'm not trying to have like a fucking crazy ass. I just need my ass proportionate to my quads, and they're not right now. I have gargantuan quads and just glutes, eh. You know, it's not small, it's just not proportionate to my fucking quads. So we're focusing glutes right now and uh, hitting those as much as I can. I, even when I was uh, squatting, I was really trying to drive with those glutes the whole time, just engage those. My momentum connection on those kind of blows. So we're just trying to 
catch that shit up and do what we're supposed to do. Start from the bottom, then make my way to the top, girl, you so tasty. It's insanity, what is your fantasy? I wanna make it come true. I'm addicted, girl, you got me lifted. I love everything that you do. I'll talk to you with eyes and O's and fuck you like a prostitute. I love the way your body move on me. On me. She wanna do me on the camera She love the paparazzi I play a little music, she a dancer Have you been a bad girl? Are you not? Yeah, you have not felt anything like this feeling I wanna give you I'm gonna film you The pleasure continue I wanna get in you, girl She wanna be just like daddy So you know I had to zap In the kitchen, fuck your pants up when I'm done, she clean the pants up. She think the trap is romantic. She said my side doing damage. In the room, private dance side. She just wanna fuck. All right, we just finished calf raises. Uh, notice how much weight I use. It's actually really lightweight. You don't need to go heavy on calves. The calves is not a big muscle to overload and push like 300 fucking pounds. You don't want to bounce at the bottom. That Achilles tendon. When you're, when you're going down the calf raise, is a very reboundable tendon, very strong. When you go down and you immediately shoot back up, you're not using calf. That, that tendon is stretching and it's just fucking shooting back up whenever you go up. So when you get to that bottom stage in the calf raise, you wanna just let it sit there. You, Cause you want that Achilles tendon to fully stretch out, not have any, any give in it. So when you go back up, you're, pull, you're pushing with calf. You're not pushing with the tendon, so. It'll completely change how you do calf raises. Uh, you'll, you'll feel it way more. They'll start growing, actually. If you're not just getting one strong ass fucking tendon, you're, you're building that muscle on that calf. So we just finished that leg workout. Kind of a really well-rounded leg workout. We hit every part. Focus a little more on the hamstrings and the glutes, um, especially when I was squatting. But yeah, we hit it all. I've been giving you guys a little physique update. I basically don't want to flex and like get naked and shirtless in here every day, but I am going to show you some legs. Also, I don't know how to flex my legs really, not from like a posing standpoint. So if it's dog shit, it's dog shit. Speed. I am speed. One winner, 42 losers. I eat losers for breakfast. Speed. I'm faster than fast, quicker than quick. I am lightning. Hey, lightning, you ready? Oh, yeah. I don't know if that was like weird as fuck or not, but <laughs> I was just flexing my legs, uh, showing you the size compared to the rest of my body. It's really hard to like get good angles too, because I'm just filming everything by myself, so I just legit carry this box around in the gym and I set up my tripod on it and I just try to get the best angle I can. Sometimes I can work out with Trent, like that first video, and he can get like more interactive angles and shit, but he has been coming in the afternoon and I have shit to do in the afternoon. So I've just been grinding what the fuck I can when I can. So yeah, I'll catch you guys in the car. All right, we just finished that leg workout. Um, it felt really good actually. I haven't been hitting them nearly as much as I should have just because I just didn't think I needed to. I've been, I mean, I haven't really lost size, maybe a little bit. I have lost a little size, but I've just really wanted to catch up my upper body. I've, because I was doing an upper lower split, so I was hitting lower body just as much as I was upper body. And there's a lot more muscles upper body than there is lower body. So my legs were just overlapping everything else um, so I backed off the volume on them and started putting more on you know my chest and other lagging parts just to play catch up basically and I may have may have overshot that a little bit and didn't do enough leg volume but we don't have tiny ass legs obviously uh, if they were tiny as fuck I'd be they I wouldn't let them get tiny as fuck you know because that it just those dudes with little chicken legs and just fat ass fucking arms and uh, a giant upper body, that doesn't look good. That doesn't look good at all. You know it doesn't look good too. If you're that guy, go hit legs. You need to go hit legs right now. But 
yeah, we just smashed that shit. We didn't hit anything else. We just smashed legs and um, had a blast in there. Uh, try to get as good ass angles. Um, but yeah, if you fuck with this workout, uh, I'm gonna put it in the description and go try it yourself. Also, um, leave a comment and subscribe. I've been forgetting to say that shit. I feel like I should say that because everyone else says that. Uh, so you know where the fuck those buttons are at. Hit them and see you guys in the next video.